Hello, I'm Cynthia Burkhardt. I'm a research director with IDC Health Insights. My research area is about accountable care technology. I think it's about priorities. That's one of the big challenges of CIOs. There's more regulation, there's more um, demands from customers, there's infrastructure that needs to be fixed. So I think it's really about priorities. How do I decide what's important um, when everything seems equally as important? Well, it's actually a very interesting market in terms of procurement. Um, I think there are some of the models that I talked about earlier, which is I'm a provider and I need um, health plan capabilities, so I will buy that. Um, there are new applications coming into the market. One of the successful approaches, I think, is going to be one that marries technology with services. We're talking about putting health plan technology into providers, and they're just going to scratch their heads. They're not going to know what to do with it. So I think it's the winning strategy more long term, I think, is going to be packaging the technology with the domain expertise and the training, not just on how to use the technology, but what organizations need to do to do population health management, for example. Well, one finding which I found really interesting and kind of supported some of the other findings was when we asked our survey respondents what was driving their accountable care initiatives, the health plans talked about strategic importance. So they talked about things like growth. They talked about competitive advantage, whereas the providers focused on reform, so it's a more reactive, a more tactical approach, and I think that's probably reflective of another data point, which is 75% of the payers are investing between one and ten million dollars in technology for accountable care, while 75% of providers are investing less than a million dollars. So I think those two really go hand in hand. Well, I think on the payer side, because they're kind of more advanced, I think really taking a look at what payers are saying they're going to do, which is we're going to provide a technology platform for providers, and begin to understand that it isn't a friend that you're selling it to or that you're providing it to, and that there's a whole level of technical support training and this domain expertise that need to be pulled together. Um, I think from the provider point of view, it's, um, it's about partnership. They can't go it alone. So begin to make friends with your payer CIOs and, and begin the discussion of how are we going to attempt to get there together.